four simple steps that you must follow if you want to be a successful dropshipper creating a successful Shopify store in 2024. What's going on, guys? My name is George Lee, aka at Truly Living. And what I do is I help people learn how to become a professional dropshipper. Not because I want everybody to leave their jobs, but because I want everyone to have a bit more freedom. I want everyone to be able to do something online that can make enough money for you to have complete financial freedom. Okay, now guys, you're not going to get it just by watching this one video, but you're going to have a very good starting block. If you go through this whole YouTube channel, you will have every single tip trick that I have to give you to make a lot of money. Now, please do not take gospel for every single word that I say is going to work for you, but it worked for me. So what I'm saying in a nutshell is if you follow these videos, if you follow these steps, if you follow the proven methods, there is a high chance that you can reach the success that all of us are doing in dropshipping right now. So let's get straight into what I've got today. First thing we're going to do, guys, is product research. Okay, so go over to shopplus.net. Now, shopplus.net is actually very, very interesting. It's a really cool program. Over here, you can actually find how to find your own winning products, analyze different shop, pick influencers, TikTok ads, things like that. So if you click on one of these, okay, the first thing it's going to do is give you the information on starting a free trial. I recommend if you are brand new into this, start your free trial, okay? Just see, you got nothing to lose because once you're inside, you're going to get so many different products, finding winning one, identifying growth opportunities and things like that, okay? The pricing for this is actually not that bad, okay? Again, do not pay anything until you have started the free trial, guys, okay? This isn't me trying to get you in because an affiliate program that you can see up there, I don't even, there's not even going to be a link below this video. This is just what I use. I'm trying to get you into this. I don't want you to feel forced into choosing a program that I use. But ShopPlus is really, really cool. You can actually find all different stores that are selling the winning products you're looking for and get proper insights on them. The next thing you need to focus on is the themes for your Shopify store. Guys, if you have no idea what I'm talking about, okay, set your Shopify store up today. It costs like, I think it's a dollar for the first three months. All right, super, super cheap. And start going through the themes. Now, you can see when you go into Shopify, okay, there's a lot of free themes. Now, I promise you 10,000 people probably every single month use the same free theme you use. I'm not saying it won't work. You can see this free theme here, okay, with these hats looks quite cool. I'm saying if you actually have a budget, if you can afford to buy a theme that fits perfectly with the winning product that you just found on the previous program, you will stand out more. There's a reason people pay for these themes. There is places you can go and get these themes a lot cheaper. I like to get it straight from Shopify because I know it works and integrates perfectly. Okay, I just go on here and I pick a theme that goes perfectly with my product. What should we be looking for when we're setting these themes up? Okay, your brand is super, super important. And like I said, anyone could just put a shop up. So it needs to be a professional looking brand. So if you're going for clothing, t-shirts and jackets, you can see this mandolin theme here. Okay, it's looking very, very professional. I like the way the guy actually goes through the top banner. Okay, it looks really cool instead of getting cut off like this. You got to think about your audience and your tone of voice. Let me use a perfect example. Okay, this here, elegant glassware. If this was loud, vibrant colors, okay, pink, rainbows, things coming on like that, it's not going to look like this elegant glassware product, right? Just like this, in industrial design meets fashion. If that was crazy pop-ups coming everywhere, it's not going to look design meets fashion. Okay, you've got to stand out to the crowd, just like this refresh. It's a blue. It's cool. It looks nice. It's straight to the point. Okay, look to target the audience that you're actually trying to target, not just targeting every single human, because most of the humans that see your product probably will not want to buy it. Another tip when doing that is if you are getting product, make sure you go over to Canva, get a subscription. Okay, you can actually make some really cool designs on there. Just type in Shopify. It will help you. Instead of just posting a picture of your product, don't just get your phone out. If you're selling this remote, take a picture of it and put it up. Okay, use Canva, get some nice background in it, change the colors, make sure the colors match the exact color on your store. Make sure you're trying to make your brand as professional as possible. So now you've done your product research, you have your store set up, you've took some time building your brand, you need to run some ads. The best ads you can run are on Facebook. Guys, I talk about a lot of different ads through this channel, TikTok organic, Facebook ads, Instagram reels, but the easiest one that I think is Facebook ads, and that's if you have money to put into it. If you don't, then I would say TikTok organic ads, but we're talking about Facebook ads today. They are the easiest if you can just drip money into different campaigns. Guys, there will be videos that you need to watch on how to set up ads, how to run ads. This isn't that. But what I'm showing you today is Facebook has the largest community of people that will watch your ad. That's a fact. Okay, TikTok, they will skip through it too foot. So if you have a professional, sleek looking ad, perfectly matching your product, people will watch it. That's just the statistic. How do you find these ads? Go to places, go to places like Big Spy, go to PP ad. Okay, if you don't know what them are, again, go through this channel because I drop this value every single video. Okay, go on there and find ads that are working for your product. The best 
research you can do is if you see an ad that you like, there's a million percent chance that other people like it. Okay, if you've already liked it, other people will. So replica the ad, get the ad, make it very, very similar, but one tiny bit better. That's all you've got to do, guys. Okay, find stuff that works and make it a little better. People that build houses, they don't build brand new designs all across the streets. They build the same house every time and make it a little bit better. Maybe better windows, better pipe, better bricks. Okay, that's what they do. That's what you do in drop shipping as well. And then that leads me on to the last point, suppliers and fulfillment centers. Now, of course, we're on fulfillment channel and I'm going to show you why they are the best supplier and fulfillment service out there. Fulfillment is definitely the best one out there. Okay, make sure you hit get a free quote. I don't just say this because I love working with the channel. I say this because I physically use fulfillment for everything I do in drop shipping. Okay, they have everything you need to handle their full order. The China source and the crowdment fulfillment, Amazon, FBA services, the product photography, private line, which is if you watch these videos, you'll understand how insane it is. Okay, we actually have clients that will tell you the truth. Just like me, guys, I promise you, I don't work for fulfillment. I use them, which is why I represent the channel. They changed my life. I want to help them change yours. So make sure you hit that get a free quote button, guys, and get involved right now. But do me a huge, huge favor. If you got value from this video, hit that like button, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell if you want to be notified about the next video because I'm about to make it very, very soon. And I'll see you there.